Hey everybody, Ogre here again for Ogre Breaks, doing a little pack opening. I was able to get five of these uh, factory sealed packs. Uh, these were like Walmart, uh, I'm sorry, Walgreens uh, repack. They are, they are by MJ Holding as well. Um, basically, it's two packs of baseball cards. Uh, I just went ahead and opened up four of them to start off, but basically each one gives you a pack of Gypsy Queen and a pack of Stadium Club from this past year. Uh, these are $8 each, so, you know, $4 a pack with them being technically a repack. It's kind of the going rate. I think normally Gypsy Queen packs were $3 each, if I remember correctly. Um, the Stadium Club, though, I usually don't see repacked, um, but they do have... So I guess these were actually a retail box. I personally didn't see any of the... Uh, the retail box is a stadium club. I did see this, the Gypsy Queen, but figured do these through an opening just for the heck of it. Uh, see if we get a little lucky with anything. Like I said, $8 for the two packs. So let's see if we get lucky. Gypsy Queen, Stadium Club, two of two of the products that I personally like, and they kind of tape the pack, packs down, so they're, they got extra tape on them. I don't think they'll be searched or anything like that. I'm not personally worried about that, but see if we get lucky with a little something. Uh, Woodford, Sanchez, TJ Antone, Andres Jimenez, Hater, and Sam Huff, rookie. So, I mean, five out of six cards, rookie cards. Just seeing, yeah, no bazooka back. So, um, so these were actually packs from a retail box, um, not a hobby box, but a retail box. And I don't think there was any exclusives for the retail boxes that I can recall. Um, I know the blaster boxes had one green parallel per pack. Um, I opened up a few of these once Target did start stocking cards again, but couple of numbered cards, nothing real crazy I pulled out of them personally, but Jesus Aguilar, Will Myers, Duke, uh, Hugh Darvish, uh, Jose Guzman, Scooball, and Charlie Morton, no missing nameplates, no uh, team uh, text variations, so nothing really there. That pack definitely a lot rougher than the first one. So we'll see You know if we get a little lucky. I thought, you know, what the heck, do a video of these. I like Stadium Club. I like Gypsy Queen, so it doesn't hurt to open up a little bit more of it. We got Thomas Hatch, Matt Chapman, Tommy Stella, Aquino, Trevor Story, and Carpenter. And, yeah, no bazooka backs, no missing nameplates. No, actually, not even an insert card yet, either. I don't know. I mean... You know, could these have potentially been searched? I have no idea, honestly, but I figure this extra tape on here is actually kind of annoying. Um, but I, I don't know. Usually something that's repacked like that, the way it is, usually doesn't have any signs of tampering, to, to my knowledge. Usually they just kind of put in, you know, not the greatest packs as a whole, but... Uh, Luis Patino, Clark Schmidt, Cody Bellinger, Corey Seager, uh, Mondesi, and Dustin May. But uh, yeah, nothing. Yeah, nothing really worthwhile. All right, last pack of Gypsy Queen, then I'll take us to the Stadium Club cards. Which you know, Stadium Club always a fun opening. I love the the pictures that they use in it. Alejandro Kirk. Not a bad rookie card there. Marcana, Trevor Bauer, Jeff McNeil, Keeper Ruiz, and Daz, uh, Daz Cameron. So not even a numbered card. Eh, it's okay, though. Didn't really hit any of the big rookies either, but eh, it could be worse. All right, let's do Stadium Club. Like I said, five, five packs of Stadium Club. And this extra tape, it just makes this just more of a pain in the ass to open, really. All right, here we go. 
We got Cronenworth, rookie card. Okay, I think that's probably been the best rookie card we've pulled all day. Uh, Sapia, Debbie Garcia. Let's go this way. Jeff McNeil, Reggie Jackson. Uh, Lou Gehrig, Salvador Perez, Tim Anderson, and Jacoby Jones, which actually these are supposed to be, right? That was supposed to be a five card pack, right? Yeah, five card pack. We got uh, what? Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. So got a couple extra cards there. Some, you know, okay rookie cards. Nothing earth shattering, but. Uh, let's see what we got next pack. Uh, feels more like five cards potentially here. Zach Gallon. Trey Turner. We got Anderson Tejada. And Frank Thomas. Throwback. Flashback. Insert. And Chris Bryant. <coughs> Excuse me. It's a little more like it with what we should have been getting card wise. So we got Reese Haskins and Carlos Santana. Uh, Red Foil, Santana. Paul Goldschmidt. Foil, or Chrome, I should say. So not bad getting a Chrome there. Dylan Carlson, okay. And. Jack Flaherty. So happy pulling a Carlson. Excited to see what he does next year with the Cardinals. And then Paul Goldschmidt Chrome. I'll take it. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, two packs left. But like I said, I figured I'd open up a couple of these just to see if you know any of you guys have seen the. They had some big displays actually at the Walgreens that I went to where they had uh, Donruss football from this year. They had. Chronicles basketball, Illusions basketball. I feel like there was something else in there too that I might be forgetting, but these were the only baseball cards that they had. Tristan McKenzie, rookie card. Okay, not bad there. Buster Posey, red foil. All right. Then we got Dominic Smith, Charlie Blackman, and Ryan McMahon. So brings us to our last pack. The extra tape on these packs is extremely annoying. So, all right, here we go. We got Max Muncy, Wilson Contreras, got Devin Williams, and we got Ted Williams and Black Foil Ted Williams. Kind of funny to see back to back, but overall, pretty much. It's pulled kind of what I was expecting to pull. I wasn't expecting to pull any huge, you know, cards. I wasn't expecting any autographs or anything like that. But figured I'd open these up just to, you know, just to kind of show if you guys saw these at any of your local Walgreens. Like I said, they were $8 each. So basically you get two packs of cards for $8, pack of Gypsy Queen, pack of Stadium Club from this year. Um, so figured I'd do a quick little opening of it. But with that, appreciate you guys, you know, watching the video. If you liked what you saw, I greatly appreciate it. Leave a like on the video. Leave any comments on these uh, Walgreens packs, you know, are these, you know, two products that you personally don't want to open up any more of or open any of to begin with, or, you know, whatever the case is. So definitely let me know in the comments. And if you haven't subscribed, greatly appreciate if you subscribe, hit that notification bell for any of my future uploads. And with that, I want to thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.